Evidence-based teaching practices have grown in importance as STEM fields have sought to improve learning and increase the number of graduates from their programs. For those practices to thrive, we must have an effective means of evaluating teaching. Our project, known as TVAL, provides a framework for that. TVAL involves four public research universities. Three are using a common framework to articulate a more meaningful approach for documenting, recognizing, and rewarding high-quality teaching. The fourth is studying the change process at those universities. The project is pursuing three main questions. How can we make the elements of effective teaching more visible in the evaluation process? How can we give greater structure and consistency to the evaluation of teaching? And how can we use the evaluation process to foster improvement? Traditionally, universities have relied on end-of-semester student surveys to evaluate teaching. Those surveys have come under increasing scrutiny, though, and focus on only a small portion of what goes into an effective class. The TVEL project broadens the means of evaluation using an adaptable rubric to identify the many elements of the teaching process. Rather than using a single lens, students, the TVEL process draws on evidence from the instructor, from peers, and from students to create a more meaningful evaluation of teaching. The TVAL framework breaks down teaching into seven component areas and allows departments to better differentiate among tiers of quality. The project, which is in its second year, has also created communities of change within and across participating universities. Guided by the TVAL team, teams within participating departments in STEM and non-STEM fields work at shaping the rubric for their disciplines and at finding common ground among colleagues. They share their experiences and learn from colleagues in regular campus meetings. Once a year, departmental representatives from each university gather for a knowledge exchange. That exchange provides yet another means for information sharing, problem solving, and community building. The TVAL approach has several benefits. It creates a more nuanced and comprehensive evaluation of teaching. It helps reward instructors for the behind-the-scenes work they do in creating, revising, and teaching their classes. It allows truly excellent teachers to stand out. It gives evaluators a tool for providing clearer feedback to instructors and for evaluating instructors for annual reviews and promotion and tenure. And it helps align the evaluation process with what we know about effective teaching practices. The project's multi-university approach also has important implications nationwide. Four-year public colleges and universities account for 40% of the 17 million undergraduates enrolled in U.S. universities, so the work in this project will provide models for change at hundreds of similar institutions that enroll millions of students. At a broader level, this system can work as a powerful lever for change by rewarding and spreading the use of evidence-based educational practices. Eventually, we see the TVAL system as an important step toward better recognition of teaching at research universities and toward improved learning among students in all fields. That is a grand goal, but we think the TVAL approach puts it within reach.